We are all guilty of giving our opinions about what someone could do to make themselves look a little better. So KTLA took it to the next level in a new segment called Stranger Changer. Our first makeover candidate is Alice. She's from the city of Glendora. We had Alice stand for one hour in a public place while strangers filled out surveys on what they would change about her. We then gave the survey results to our style team and they had to apply those suggestions on Alice. Here's what happened. Occasionally I've gone out with my children and they say, isn't it nice that your grandmother's with you today? And I'm like, oh no. We put Alice behind the red ropes of our stranger chamber at Westside Pavilion. And we're asking people in the mall what they think we should do for her makeover. Helping to gather style opinions were real life stylist Crystal Fambrini. What do you think she needs to get done today with her makeover? And the stranger changer style team. Wow. She needs a lot of work. We drew quite a crowd of people wanting to give their style tips for Alice. I like fresh things. Yeah. It should be comfortable but stylish. We should take the shoes off and burn them. I think she needs darker hair. That's what my grandma has. The survey included multiple options for what they thought was best suited in hair color and cut, as well as clothing style and makeup. Her hair needs to be brunette, straightened, um, a blunt cut. She should go with black hair. Yeah, bring out her eyes. What do you think about her wardrobe? There's something casual, a little more upbeat. A little bit brighter of colors. Something a little more fitting. Better shoes, <laughs> definitely. After an hour in the stranger chamber, we tallied up all the responses and headed to Macy's, where Alice tried on her first outfit. Oh, what do you think? Is this you? Some of it. Okay. I like the shoes. They're comfortable. I'm not quite sure about the lace and the leggings, whether it's the right look for me. You like it? I do, I do. I think it's a little dressy but, and still comfortable and nice. And now we have more of a business day look. What do you think about I this? I like the black pants mm -hmm. and the length is nice. The jacket is nice. It's different and it gives that dressed up look. Next, we move to Lane Bryant, a paradise for the plus-size woman of style. I love it. We got the ballet shoes with the little beads on them. We have the jeggings of a bright, bold color. The lace is very on-trend and figure flattering. Yes, I like it. Welcome to the good life. Oh. And finally, we stop in Beverly Hills for a new hair color and cut at Gavert Atelier Salon. Dark hair would be too high maintenance for her. We're gonna go for a nice, warm, like a gold chestnut tree base with a couple of softer blonde highlights around the hairline. Adding a more layer to giving more flow and a sexy. And make up with a unique eyebrow session by Valerie Beverly Hills. What I'm going to do is fill in her brows and I'm going to even out her skin. I'm going to do a lot of work under her eyes though because this is what makes her look older. And we're going to even out her skin and then I'm going to contour her right into here to give her face a narrower look and it'll give it a freshness and we'll put a little pink on the apple. We're going to make it really easy so that she can do it at home. Joining me now, real life stylist Crystal Fambrini. You've seen her on our show before. Good morning, Crystal. Good morning. Along with more than 20 of Alice's family members, friends, co workers, church group, and Girl Scout troop. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Are we excited? Alice is very loved. Alice is very <laughs> loved. And before we reveal Alice's new look, here's the survey results of what the majority of strangers wanted to change about Alice. Now, mind you, Alice wanted a makeover. We're not pushing her into this. Right. Strangers came by and mentioned, hey, maybe her hair should be darker and shorter. Her clothing style should be casual but slightly tailored. Her makeup, a natural fresh face. And then when it came to her accessories, less is more. Right. I think we can handle that, Crystal. Yes, I think so. So are we ready? Yes! So exciting! So exciting! Okay, so now it is time to reveal her new look, Alice! Come on out! That was so fun! Amazing, amazing! Alice! Hi! 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 Good to see you again. How are you? Fine. Fabulous. What do you think? By the way, Nice. All right. So cute. So I actually have a quick present for her as well because she loved this jacket at Macy's. So we ended up giving present you this Alice. jacket wow, as well. Nice. This is going to look fabulous. You can yes. wear it every day. Thank you. So here you go. You. So Alice. 
Next, I've got to ask. Uh, we want to show the before, so right. you get a look at what Alice looked like when we took her. We took her to the mall. <laughs> wow. And wow. then the after. You're a glamour girl in the after shot, Alice. How about that? How does it feel? It sounds great. So, what made you decide? You know what? I'm going to go to the mall and have strangers uh, tell me what I should change about my <laughs> wardrobe and my hair. What I got to lose? You know, you everybody has good opinions and. Oh my goodness. And we did it at Westside Pavilion with love, you know? We weren't like making oh, yeah, fun of fun. her. It, it was, was just all, you know, constructive criticism, all for the positive, and we did all of this in one day. Did you ever think that you could have this dramatic of a change no. in just a few hours? Just a few hours. Yeah. yeah. I heard you've under you, you've undergone some major changes, including a huge weight loss for yes. you. How much? About 150 pounds, about four years ago. So Amazing. unbelievable. So this is a whole new Alice. So now that you have your makeover, what do you want to do? Do you want to go somewhere? Do you want to have a big night on the town? Oh, sure. <laughs> Alice is yeah, up for anything. You bet. We want to thank everybody who helped us with this fun mm -hmm. makeover. Westside Pavilion for today's makeover fashions provided by Macy's and Lane Bryant. Our makeover hair color and cut are provided by Gavert Atelier Salon in Beverly Hills and Alice's eyebrow session. And look at those brows. They frame the eyes by Valerie Sarnell of Beverly Hills. And you can check out more about Stranger Changer. Go to Crystal Fambrini's Style Scene Daily website for all the information. Go to KTLA.com. So what do we think of Alice's new look? Thank you, Alice. It was a lot of fun. You're a good sport, too. You look gorgeous. Thank you. Uh, still ahead, our weather is slightly warming up. Henry's going to be here with some showers in our forecast. We'll be right back to tell you about it. Amazing. Plus, a study it is amazing. <laughs> a study linking childhood vaccines and autism has parents all around the world since 13 years ago worried. Now a new article says it might have been doctored. We'll bring you the whole story after the break.